end of year cosmic chat. So let's do an end of year cosmic chat and talk about where we're going. Okay, I'm not going to do it long. This is just a, a pick me up for the end of the year. I want you guys to jump into 2023 with a clear mindset. Now you all know that um, what I focus on is I use astrology, but more karmic astrology as well as coaching and healing and mindset shift. Okay, so the little cosmic chat we're going to have today is as we enter the new year of 2023, okay, it's not just a new year, but it's a new, I, I want you guys to think of it this way. Oh, new year, new me. It's not a new year, new me. It's a new energy, okay? So the new energy for 2023 is a seven energy. Again, if you are if you don't understand numerology, go add up the numbers to 20 plus 23, right? You end up with 43 and the two and or the four and the three end up with seven. So 20, the year 2023 is an, a seven energy representing spiritual energy and the energy of truth. So spiritual energy, faith, truth, spirit, okay? That's what we're moving into. And now we have this jam up of Capricorn energy right now happening in the our cosmic, right? In the cosmic, you know, gal galactic higher energy frequencies. So we go just we know that there's a ton of Capricorn energy of truth, right? Then we go, we're in Mercury retrograde, which is also sitting. Mercury is looking backwards and Mercury is sitting in Capricorn. And so it's looking back for non-truth. All right. So the fact that we're sitting and we're dealing with non-truth. Okay. So you're looking back and you're looking at Capricorn energy, Mercury retrograde in retrograde. Doesn't mean Mercury retrograde, you guys, let me be clear, does not mean no. It means slow. So you're going to get all the things you're working on and moving forward in. It just means you need to slow down. It's the pause button and it's pausing truth. And it's saying, look back if any of these structures, organizations, um, externally from government to families to paradigms to religion to schools, any structures that have non-truth, you're going to get revealed for it and you're going to live forward in truth. So... Um, my presentation for you guys to think about presenting you for a new mindset of 2023. Get ready to dump and jump. That's the best way I can teach you guys this quickly. And you don't need to do this long. It doesn't need to be messy, right? So dump non-truths. Okay, that's where we're going to sit. Dump, dump, you're going to dump non-truths. If you have to own your shit, a lot of you are going to have to own some shit. All the stuff's coming up. You can't hide from it. Just hop on Twitter. You can see it coming up, right? You have to jump into non-truths. And some, some people might have to own their shit that you thought was true that is not true now. That's dumping. It doesn't make right or wrong. Nobody's right or wrong. It's just going, I thought that was true. It's not true anymore. Oh, I knew that was true. Move forward with truth. Okay? So dump non-truths. And then number two, jump into the truth revolution. And I am bringing you into this truth revolution. It's all over my website. It's all over half the people you're talking to right now want to talk truth. Jump on with them, okay? So I want you guys to kind of dra wrap your brain around doing this on New Year's Eve, right? Happy New Year's Eve, by the, by the way, um, is to get all, let go of the one day bullshit, okay? There's not just one day. I want you to shift into the all day, every day mindset for your new life. 2023 isn't about new me, right? Because the old me is no good. You guys have to get off this good, bad. That's the old paradigm bullshit. You're all bad. You're all sinners. You're all suffering. You're all no good. This is total bullshit, right? They're a celebrity. You're nothing bullshit, okay? It's the new me is my new reality, right? And new reality is living the truth revolution. I cannot emphasize this any more um, clear than I can right now because if you can understand just opening your mindset to that will change everything. So I want you to seriously ask yourself, okay? Spirit, seven rules spirit, rules spirituality, it rules source, it rules divine, it rules spiritual intervention, it rules spirit guides, guardian angels, spirit in some form, God, source, universe, okay? So whatever source God consciousness you follow, 
that's where you're looking for this new energy, okay? So can you seriously sit down in this truth revolution that we're moving into, that's 2023, seven vibration frequency, okay? Can you sit facing God, source consciousness, whatever your God is, okay? Sit knee to knee, spirit, let's go up into, into the universe, up into space, and you're sitting knee to knee right now, okay? It's a new year, you're walking in. And could you say to source consciousness, yes, I am living my truth in all aspects. And God says, are you really? Most people will say no, right? Most people cannot come clean with going, yeah, I know my truth. My soul knows I'm not living my truth at the highest level. Because your soul knows where to navigate you to expand reality that vibrates truth. And our egos for so long, thousands of years have been in control of that. That if we are matching external realities, and so we were living from outside in, this new universe, the new truth revolution is inside out. What is the inside truth? And are you living that and pressing it out like a lighthouse out to the world? Okay, so are you hiding from your truth? Are you hiding from the truth that you need to sit into? Okay, your soul knows where to go, you guys. And if it's not, it's time to stop hiding from it. The truth revolution that is breaking open says, yeah, you know, when you're living in that, you're like, yeah, I'm, I'm effing done with dancing around what doesn't make me feel good. You have to be done with it. And so it's pretty simple. Okay, so what I want you guys to focus on is these two tips for the new year. Okay, these are your new year's tips of revolutionizing your new reality, your new reality, 2023 reality, okay? 2023 isn't a new me, it's a new reality for you to be in, okay? So number one, detox. Detox the crap out of your body, out of your mind, and out of your spirit. And what do I mean by that is body, right? So physically detox all the toxins that have or are, you have been or you have been in the past or are in the current digesting okay you're in ingesting i should say and purge them detox your physical form okay also because we're in mercury retrograde physical house physical environments your physical offices your physical cars all of it detox okay by the way go feel free to comment in here when you're feeling this pull because I know you're all feeling pulled to detox something like things just don't feel right it's because you need to purge. It's not truthful for you anymore. Your new revolution is to maybe purge your whole reality in your in your house, okay? In your home, in your physical body. So, one detox your body. Two, mental detox. And what does that mean? Just kind of check your 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 thoughts like what do you think about? What do you look at? What do you want on social media? What what do you talk about? Who do you commune with? Who do you connect with? What are you talking about all the time? Is it negative and toxic? Clean it up, right? So dump any constricting mindset that's holding you back. And then last, spiritual detox. This is going to be a hard one because a lot of you are going to get tripped up with this given that we're going into a seven year of spiritual insight. What is spiritually truthful? What is this truth revolution? That is seven spiritual warrior shit. I mean, this is deep, okay? And so do you have to kind of clear some of the beliefs that are shackles that are causing you in the past to sacrifice and suffering in this old bullshit mentality, this old spiritual mentality, right? God's source loves us with no rules. That's what God's source is. That's what unconditional love is. Okay, so number one, detox, body, mind, spirit. And number two tip is tap. Tap into your nervous system. Tap into your thymus. You guys, tap into your hearts, okay, all day long, daily, hourly if you need to for the next several weeks through this Mercury retrograde, which is pulling you into non-truths to see them, okay? And tapping, tap in, I am courage, I am love, I am truth. Do it again. I am courage, I am love, I am truth. And tap it into your thymus. You can even rub it and you can feel if it's sore. It's wanting you to break it open into this heart, nervous system consciousness and saying, what do I want into the new reality? What is my truth revolution? Where am I walking as a badass? Okay? And so this truth revolution, you guys, means releasing resistance to systems that shackle you to things that constrict you. 
they constrict you to holding back and being small. And this is a big deal because a lot of people are like, yeah, yeah, Don. Okay, I, I am preparing you. I'm delivering you information to help you get to this next reality. And a lot of people are like, yeah, yeah, yeah. When it hits you, it will hit you hard because you're not prepared. Okay, do, am I detoxing? Friends, family, body, health, wealth, emotions, spirit. We're walking into, I'm unloading all my new events in the new year on detoxing, on living consciously, getting rid of constricting thoughts and consciously creating expanded thoughts. If you're not doing that, it will hurt you enough. Con physically, emotionally, spiritually, beliefs, friendships will leave, break you, hurt you. So you can go, oh my God, that's not my truth anymore. No shit. It's what it's time for us to get into, okay? So I want you guys to join me for all these expansion events. Just click on the link in my bio. It'll take you right to my link tree. Um, and you'll see all the events coming up, but mostly join me on Monday for the new year, January 2nd, okay? And we're gonna deep dive into the truth of, of living as a spiritual warrior all day, every day. Not just today, not just on the new year. Oh, I'm gonna start a, a new year's resolution. I don't want you to resolve anything anymore. I want you to step into re, a revolutionary thought pattern, revolutionizing how you think, what your consciousness state is. So any questions, you guys, any comments, I would love to answer on this because this is where we're going. A seven frequency, a spiritual, enlightened, truth, new year. And if you can step into the truth revolution, you will be absolutely expanded into mind-blowing successes and joys and love and spiritual truth because being a relationship coach I need you guys to understand this is the relationship you have with everything in your life, with your self-worth, your money, your communication, your family, your friends, your spouse, your career, your reality to the world. It's time to revolutionize who you are, where you're going, because that's what this new year is going to do and it's going to pull you in like a vacuum. So I, I wish you guys absolutely the happiest new year be happy tonight. Be safe tonight. I'm not really going out, going to dinner, but not, not going to stay up too late. I don't even know if I'll make it to midnight. I'm typically not a late night person. So um, my friends, I will see you in the new truth revolution. I am here for you. I love you. Brightest blessings. And I will see you in 2023.